Good evening, everybody, and welcome to the 2020 Game Awards, which has a few differences. One, as you can hear, there's no audience this year. Normally, we have a big audience, but due to the state of the world, we can't currently have that. Number two is that I'm zooming this in, and by that, I don't mean I'm doing it via video call. I'm um, just handing this in really fucking late. Sorry, Matt. And the third difference is that we're going to spread it out over all of Advent. Oh yes, this is going to be a 25 part series going from now until Christmas Day of the top 25 games of the year. And why are we doing it this way? Well, it's very simple. I'm very lazy. And there's a second reason. Now I can't think of one. Anyway, shall we get started? No, because we need to talk about the rules. So this is going to be what I consider to be the very best game of the year. Well, that'll be on the 25th. We're going all the way back. This is the starting of the 25th best game of the year. And I'm just doing best to worst using the uh, following mathematical equation that Matt's going to put on the screen right now. And um, there's a few things that will not be in this list. There's a few types of games and stuff. I'm just going to go through that now so you don't feel the comments. With... Here we go. Games like Cyberpunk 2077 will not be on this list. And why are you asking? Well, it's not fucking out yet, is it? And I've got to record this in November. December the 1st, the morning. Shh! But, you know, it... <laughs> Such a prick. But it's not out. I'm not putting in the list if it's not out. Maybe next year, Cyberpunk. Uh, games like Doom Eternal, Half-Life Alex, Resident Evil 3 Remake, Final Fantasy 7 Remake. They're not uh, going to be in this list. Why? I haven't played them. Everything in this list has to be a game that I have played. Otherwise, well, the whole, li the whole concept of this fuckery falls apart. Uh, things like Among Us is not going to be in this list. Why? It didn't come out this year. It didn't come out this year. Uh, Persona 4, which just came out on the PC, but it came out before, and it was the same kind of game, the same version, they just moved to a different thing. Their games like that, they're not going to make it. Um, the Solitaire Conspiracy is not going to make it. You know, usual Bithel rules, I can't fucking promote Bithel that much. <sighs> the amount of people that complain, I'm like, oh, Mike Bithel made a game. They're like, no, you do a Doctor Who podcast with him. I'm like, yeah, but he liked the episodes I thought was shit. I hate that man. I'm excited to watch the Christmas episode of Doctor Who, whenever that is. May, I think. Uh, and finally, the final type of game is going to be games like uh, The Last of Us Part 2, and then on this list, because I think it's shit. Uh, and apart from that, I think we're ready to go. Apart from one extra little bit of information, every other day, I'll be doing, before the reveal of the thing, I'll be doing a little Xmas ranking. A little a little top-tier list of specific Xmasy kind of things, like what's the best TV, Xmas TV special? What's the best, you know tub of chocolate what's the best vegetable I don't, you, the standard Christmasy questions we'll be answering them but anyway let's now cover game number 25 on this list of the top 25 games of 2020 it's a lot of 20s game 25 is Fall Guys now Fall Guys is a game that made me truly, once and for all, realise that I despise the human race and it's actually the perfect moral for this year other people will definitely kill you if they get too close to you. It's a, it's a game for bastards. I played it when it first came out and I was like, oh, this is shit. This is awful. I hate this experience. It's a, it's a very well made game. I'll tell you that. It's it, what it wants to do. It's doing it beautifully. And I think I've hated literally every second that I played it for. Especially the ones I played with John. I doubly hate those because John, for some reason, likes the fucking team games. And those team games are just ass. Oh, get all the eggs. Oh, everyone's taking your eggs. <laughs> I just want to just just find the people playing it and punch them in the face. Teach them some proper human contact. I'm glad it exists, Fall Guys. And it defines this year. But I never, ever, 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 ever want to play it again. And if that's not how you start a top 25 game list, I don't know how you're supposed to. 